Hi, my name is Liana and I am 11 years old. Three and a half years ago, I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes. And even if I didn't want to, this was something I had to adapt to in order to live a healthy life. My life is no longer as carefree as it used to be. Since that day, all I ever pray for is a cure to this life-changing disease. Juvenile diabetes means that my pancreas does not produce insulin anymore. Therefore, I need to be injected with insulin needles. This disease comes suddenly with no warning and its cause is unknown. Unlike what most people think, it is not caused by eating too many sweets. Since then, my life hasn't been so easy. Every time I eat, I always need to check my blood sugar and give myself insulin needles based on the amount of carbohydrates I am eating. My mom and dad used to give me my insulin needles, but now I am proud to be able to inject myself. I measure my blood sugar 8 to 10 times a day, which adds up to a total of over 10,000 finger pokes. In addition to that, I inject myself with insulin needles 4 to 6 times a day, which results to a total of 6,000 injections so far, leaving a constant reminder of this enduring disease. It is a challenge I deal with every minute, every day to balance activity, food, and insulin. Some days my sugar readings are in balance. Other days, no matter what I do, I just can't get them right. Not keeping my sugar readings in balance could lead to serious long-term complications, such as kidney failure, stroke, and blindness. Juvenile diabetes will always be part of my life, whether I like it or not. It is a disease that never goes to sleep, that I will never outgrow, and for which there is no cure. Although everyone tells me how brave I am, it is still an everyday struggle. However, I will not let diabetes bring me down. I still enjoy many activities like soccer, basketball, swimming, playing the piano, baking, and so much more. With my family, we hope and we pray every day for my dream to come true. Thanks to researchers, Type 1 diabetes has made tremendous progress in maintaining better sugar readings. However, a cure is yet to come. That's why I need your help to make all type 1 diabetics dreams come true, including mine. I invite you to join me for my first gala for Liana's Dream Foundation on November 1st, 2014 at the Sheraton. It will be plenty of fun and we will be a step closer in finding a cure to type 1 diabetes. My dream is to one day say I used to have diabetes. And now with your help, I strongly believe a cure will come. To view my website, please go to vianasdreamfoundation.org. Thank you for all your support.